And these are the best clip GUIs for the new game called Blade Ball. You can auto parry, auto farm wins, unlock all skills and a lot more. This is so OP. To download the script, go into the first link in the description, and then you'll be seeing this website as you guys can see. So the first thing you need is a Roblox executor. But if you're on mobile, you can download Codex, which is the best Android executor, and it's also completely ad-free. And you can find any script from you need from the game up as well, just like that, as you guys can see. And if you want to download these exploits, you can find a download link in the description or on the website in the middle right here, as you guys can see. Anyways, once you have an exploit, you need to get the script, and you can easily find the script you need using the search feature up the top right, right here, as you guys can see. So I'll be searching for Blade Ball, and once you enter, you'll be seeing all the results as you can see right here you can only find free scripts for now but we'll add more with time anyways i'll be downloading this one on the left just click on it and now i'll be showing you guys how you can download any script from the website so make sure to watch this carefully so once you are on the script page just go on to see download button just like this and just click on it and that will open up this page with a few steps on it and they're really simple to finish but if you need any help finishing them because you can't you can ask help for more support in discord server description so if you run into any errors or issues while downloading the exploit or the script our support will help you out and fix your issue so guys make sure to join the discord server it'll be in the description anyways let me just finish my task real quick once all of your tasks are done it will go green just like this and then just hit done and it will download the script as you can see right there and i just copy the script just press ctrl a ctrl c and open up your game now a friend of mine rings will be showing you guys how to use the script so enjoy all right before we get started if you want to know how to exploit on pc and which emulators to use and what settings they are you're gonna want to watch this video and if you want to know how to download codex you're gonna want to watch this video and if you want to know how to get the key system you're gonna want to watch this video now that that's out of the way all right i'm on the event right now the live serpent boss event so i'm just gonna paste in the script right here you can't use battle hub from the global script you have to get it from our website because the ones in global scripts are a robux stealer but if you accidentally execute it executed it it's fine we have protections against it so it won't get your robux stolen or anything else so yeah right here i've got battle hub with me and we're in the serpent boss fight event i'm just gonna enable auto parry right there and minimize that and here we are this is actually my first time in this live event i have no idea what i'm supposed to do i guess i'm just gonna keep you're supposed to just attack the boss i guess all right uh everyone is sitting right here i guess i'll st sit right here as well all right that's one tick of the hp bar gone not really you need to hit it 20 times for like some damage i'm presuming so you can't use any abilities you can only parry all right complete claim those for coins i accidentally clicked my mouse i lost one live should be fine now i think let's try to get closer so it targets me oh the auto parry doesn't work in the event that's unfortunate because you have to actually manually parry now so that's why everyone's standing here i'll try to find a script that works in the event all right five more five more hits i'm already on my last live all right that's another hit on the boss all right that's another hit on the boss and that guy's dead okay that's one bar gone and there's a cutscene all right and we're in a new place again oh no way i was supposed to jump there i wasn't paying attention all right good thing i can respawn though if not that was that would be crazy there we go all right so i'm supposed to jump and all right so you can't afk and leave it on auto parry i guess you have to actually play the game shocker and i can use my abilities now what's going on oh no way i was focusing on jumping didn't notice the ball and i died there we go all right that's three more hits for another hit on the boss hp and i dashed into the red bar okay so each time you die the respawn cooldown is even longer than before i'm gonna try not to die five more seconds to respawn all right i'm back okay got through that there we go parry that now the red zones are back gotta watch the ball and the floor oh oh okay I'm good. No, I'm not. I forgot to use my ability. So surely you can't just respawn every time. There must be a limit. Unless, if everyone dies, you can't respawn anymore. That would be crazy. No, I just respawned though. Alright, that was that was scuff. Back to the main game, I guess. Alright, I'm back in the main game. I'm just gonna show battle in the main game for a while. Execute that. Wait for it to load up. There we go. Enable auto parry. Now you can also change the time of day. I think the game looks pretty cool at night. So just drag that out right there there we go now we're up blade ball on dark mode literally
Alright, that's about it for the serpent event. That's pretty much it. I don't really got anything more to show. That's it for me this time. And I'll see y'all next video.